Hi everybody, welcome to Simply Scuba. In today's video, I'm gonna be taking a closer look at the Apex WTX mesh pouch. So this is a mesh pocket, it, uh, it bellows out. So you do actually have a surprising amount of storage inside of it. You can attach it in a couple of different ways. You can either bolt it to one of the Apex mounting points, either on one of their pouches or on the, or on the actual uh, sort of mounting plate. And um, yeah, you can use this for your backup mask or emergency storage while you're in the water. When you're not using it, it's very thin, so it's not going to take up any space or sort of drag in the water in any way. Let's take a closer look. Okay, so this is how it arrives um, with a little cardboard backer. Uh, it was cable tied. I've already undone the uh, the cable ties, uh, but the cardboard itself it uh, it has these little diagrams on the back, which is quite handy. That tells you how you can sort of attach it onto separate pouches. Uh, if you're using these kind of four grommets that you'll see in a second, uh, you will need the separate kits to uh, to actually sort of bolt it on, or use your own uh, sort of nuts and bolts to uh, to bolt it onto separate pouches. Um, but yeah, on the back, so you have these four grommets. Uh, so these are the like really secure attachment points if you're attaching onto like the large pockets. Um, but you also have this uh, sort of two inch webbing strap. So you can thread it over a, just a standard waistband and um, and then it sort of sits there pretty securely. The back of this has this um, sort of almost rubbery, plasticky um, sort of material, which is very, very strong and tough. Normally it's that sort of nylon cordura, but this this is a bit more robust. On the front, uh, you just have the uh, the flap with the embroidered Apex logo with a more standard uh, Cordura material, and that's held down in place by this uh, by this pinch clip. Fully adjustable, so if there's nothing in it, you can uh, really sort of ratchet that down so it's nice and neat and uh, and flush. But if you've got a big mask inside of it or something, then you can extend that out so you can sort of allow it to, uh, to to bellow out quickly and securely with that pinch clip uh, you can open it up and then on the insides it's all this uh, kind of mesh material it's kind of chokered at the top uh, so it's uh, it, it naturally stuff on the inside is going to want to sort of stay inside but it bellows out and you get a decent sized pouch so even if you have a framed mask you would be able to uh, sort of store that inside as long as you can get it through that uh, sort of choke point at the uh, at the top but with most masks with the skirt you can fold it in you should be able to uh, sort of get it inside or for whatever you want to um, sort of use it for if you're collecting plastic pollution or something you can stow it inside of there and keep it nice and secure and because it's mesh it means it's going to drain out as soon as you get out of the water so you're not carrying around water uh, whilst you're out so um, yeah and that's the other uh, pouch size and a nice neat little package and that's the Apex WTX mesh pouch uh, a handy sort of storage device that you can put almost anywhere that you have a two inch webbing strap when you're not using it it's nice and flat but when you need to it can bellow out so you can use it for storage uh, the mesh just allows it to drain instantaneously and because it bellows out there is a surprising amount of storage space on the inside there's going to be more information on our website simply scuba.com just click on the link down in the description below to check it out thank you for watching and of course safe diving Thank you.